person. As far as I recall, I don't think I've told a single lie in my life. Well, you certainly convinced Paimon with that speech. Don't worry, Timaeus. We won't let your determination go to waste. Thank you, Timaeus. Ah, oh, thank you, everyone. I promise to do everything I can to help. Okay, so it looks like we found our one who would never lie. Great! Let's keep it up! On to the other three! Okay, Paimon will do the honors. Ahem. We have with us here the flower, the guide, the legend, and Timaeus. Huh? Why did you only say Timaeus' name? You should say my name, too. All right, all right. We also have Klee. That's me! <laughs> Klee here. This all somehow feels like we're getting ready for a field trip. There's nothing wrong with a more relaxed atmosphere, is there? Of course. We will soon see if my hypothesis has any merit. Actually, I'm still feeling a little nervous. Me too. But weren't you all fired up just a moment ago? Uh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Actually, I'm a little worried, too. Deep breaths. Deep breaths. I know what you're feeling. Saying anything becomes so much harder when there are so many people watching. Well, does anyone know the exact location of where we're headed, or should I do a reading on my scry glass? Hmm. According to the prophecy, once we've figured out the answer, we should test it at the Lantern of Utmost Joy. Wait, but where is this lantern? Oh, we know something about that. What? Wow, that's amazing. You really know how to do everything under the sun. Then we'll let you lead the way.
It should be somewhere around here. Let me take a look. Think about it. The prophecy didn't say anything about what the Lantern Upmost Joy actually looks like, right? Maybe we've overlooked something? Traveler, are you trying to figure out something else from the paper? Let's ride it up and see where it leads us. Huh? W we'll have to fly up there? Uh, can someone carry me with them? Here. <laughs> ah, this is the first time I've ever flown like 